Golden Thread Productions is the first American theater company focused on the Middle East. One of our programs is our Theater for Young Audiences program. Golden Thread Fairy Tale players create and tour original plays based on folk tales and children's stories from the Middle East. I love working with fairy tale players because I get to see the kids react and let them learn about Middle Eastern culture. I mean, I'm an Arab and I wish that I got that when I was a kid in school. <laughs> this year we are premiering a new show called Layla's Quest for Flight. It's about a little girl who dreams about being a pilot and then she goes to the eye doctor and finds out she doesn't have 20-20 vision and is shattered by that. So all these mythical birds come and help her make her dream come true. Layla's Quest is based on two Palestinian folk tales. I play Layla's mother, I play the blacksmith, the butcher, the rich man, as well as the eye doctor and some birds. I play mainly Layla, the little girl. I'm also a storyteller. I am also a little cooking pot tonjara. I am first generation Palestinian Lebanese American, which is super cool to be able to stay with my identity while still doing theater. Our work is unique because nowhere else do you get exposed to fairy tales or children's stories from the Middle East, particularly Palestine, where we are completely surrounded with so many negative stereotypes about Palestine, about Muslims, about Arabs. Middle Eastern culture is something that we're not taught in the schools. It's really been a pleasure and a privilege to bring entertainment that is inspiring, that is about girl power to schools and to children. Folk tales all over the world are folk tales, and they all bring a wisdom with some silliness. My hope is that the kids are gonna take away some kind of familiarity with another culture, whether it's language or movement or story, and that that will help them be more inclusive with all cultures. And give children something, if they are Arab or Palestinian or Muslim, for them to feel proud of their culture and their heritage, because we're sharing music and dance also and give everyone exposure to the beauty of Palestinian culture and art. <laughs> <laughs>